Hello friends. Today we we'll look into a weird but an interesting topic that is alcohol in gardening. The benefits of alcohol and the effects of alcohol on plants. I shall talk on both ethanol that is the drinking alcohol like beer, wine, vodka and also on the isopropyl alcohol also known as the rubbing alcohol which is usually used as a bathroom disinfectant. Coming up. This topic is also for those who have a habit of dumping or throwing their leftover drinks on garden plants. So first we will list out the top 5 uses of alcohol in garden and on plants. First in the list is its use as a pesticide. Rubbing alcohol can be an effective pesticide for use against aphids, mealybugs, spider mites and white flies. Please note that rubbing alcohol if applied without dilution can burn the plants. For this you need to make a spray solution of 1 is to 10 dilution in water. First always do a patch test on a leaf and then only spray on the plants. Leave it for about 4 to 5 hours and then rinse the plant with water. Repeat this process after a week if necessary. Now the second use is as a weed killer. Whether it is drinking alcohol or rubbing alcohol, both work as weed killers. And the action is faster with higher concentrations like vodka in case of uh, drinking alcohol and uh, rubbing alcohol when undiluted also has the same action. Then the third benefit is rubbing alcohol can be used to disinfect your cutting tool or the pruner uh, like in uh, when you are growing plants from cuttings. Hydrogen peroxide is an alternative. You can also disinfect other garden tools like the germination trays and pots with rubbing alcohol. Then the fourth benefit is to trap or kill slugs and snails in garden. You can actually use beer to make a trap under the soil and uh, these slugs and snails are attracted to it and fall into the trap of the beer. Then the fifth is uh, like uh, other insects like fruit flies, cockroaches etc are also attracted uh, to these uh, fermented beverages like uh, the beer and wines and hence these insects can also be trapped. Just keep a beer can partially open and the insects attracted to it and then fly in and uh, drown it and they fail to come out of the can. So there we have it folks that was our episode on the possible uses and the effects of alcohol in gardening. This is actually a weird topic and I thought we'll share this info with you just for the sake of some uh, uh, general knowledge. If you like the video please give a thumbs up and also share with your friends on social media. Also feel free to comment below the video. Happy gardening, happy Diwali.